Start hey, what's up you guys? Shardness Prime here, giving you another Marvel Legends reveal video on the Marvel Legends Black Widow movies, Red Guardian, and Melina 2-pack. If you're trying to pre-order this set, you can do so. Big, 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 get your big badass toys at BigBadToyStore.com. Click the link in the description below. Wait, down there, I ask you to please show your love to the channel by hitting that like button and hit that subscribe button if you're new here, as well as the notification bell. And yeah, Hasbro just announced this 2-pack set out of nowhere. Well, it's a Marvel Monday, right? So there we go. Uh, two repainted figures. I don't think we're getting new body parts right here, but they look pretty good from what I can see already. I have been complaining about the lack of a helmeted head sculpt for Red Guardian forever, and I love my Beltran Bros head sculpt custom. So you can see the two uh, characters on the back of the packaging right over here. And then looking at Melina first, uh, you can see that she does have that same body mold and slightly different coloring than the white Black Widow figure that we'd seen, um, oh God, like last year, right? And the knee pads are colored this creamy white color, which is kind of interesting looking to me. And she does come with the grapple and everything, uh, which is cool. So can't wait to see the movie. It looks like she has a Black Widow symbol on there also. And then there's the two of them side by side. I, I believe these are like the parental figures for Natasha, right? That's definitely what it looked like in the trailer anyway, which I think totally makes sense having a two pack of these. And then you can see Red Guardian right over here looking pretty awesome. He has added detail uh, on that star on his chest that I didn't notice before. I didn't notice that so much in the trailers, but I think it's there. And, um, and yeah, they've added that to the figure. There's a lot more color variation throughout, a lot more stripes or straps painted white and everything. So that looks really good. And the alternate head sculpt or the new head sculpt looks way better than the previous one that we'd seen. The hair looks a whole lot better. Looks like they're using the photoreal tech right over here as opposed to the other one kind of looked really cheap to me. And then looking at the figure again with the helmeted head sculpt looks fantastic. So I'm really happy about that. So that's very cool cool to see. I love the gunmetal gray that they added to the shield as well. I think that looks dope. Uh, you can see that they included, uh, you know, ungloved hands right here. So he has the fleshy hands, wide open hands in case you need those. And then the figure also comes with the figure. So I guess there will be some kind of reference to action figures in the movie, which I'm excited to see. So that's pretty dope. So I'm, I wonder if that thing's articulated. Most likely not. But anyway, this is a cool looking two pack. I can't wait to see the movie. I know some people may see this as a pass at we at least get a new character with the Molina uh, however again I wish Hasbro could wait on their movie figures and get m the most accurate depictions of the characters from the films just on one try instead of uh, you know having us buy two figures because now I'm gonna have an extra red guardian figure and, and what am I gonna do with that it may have it may have to be customized I, I don't know. It looks like they didn't upscale the body mold either because I thought that the body mold for Red Guardian was a little on the short side. So it looks like that's all the same, of course. But, you know, it is a much better repaint or better paint job than the other version. So I want to know what you guys think. I'm definitely getting this. I'm definitely going to review it. I can see why it would be a pass for some. Uh, however, we'll see how dope these characters are in the movie. I'm sure that's going to have a huge effect on whether people are going to want these or not. So we shall see. I'd like to know what you guys think. Please let me know in the comment section below. Again, if you liked the video, please hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. And if you want to, and if you want to follow me over on social media, you can check me out on Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch. And I will have a Transformers review coming to you guys very soon. So stay tuned for that. And I will catch you guys later. Peace. Hey, new Shark Miss Prime videos. Hey, you should click one. And click on one of them. Or subscribe if you haven't. We're shot, 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 we're shot,